Are you still cool if I invite a few people over for drinks tonight? Of course, you don't need to ask permission. Uh, it's your house. And yours. Yeah. <clears throat> you may. Oh, end of a vacancy. Yeah. Uh, should I ask why you've taken to sleeping in the staff room? Because my exam room was too noisy and there are no empty wards. What's wrong with your bed? I'm not going back to that house while that disgusting lesbian is there. I thought you and Maya were friends. Not her, Jay. I won't ask. Well, luckily you've uh, patched things up with Norman. Don't it's... even talk oh. about that thoughtless, selfish, oh, oh, lying. Okay, okay. Every, everything's okay. I'll leave it to her. I want to talk about it. I'm sorry. I wasn't going to do this. Oh, don't mention it. Last night, everything got turned upside down. Not having a place to sleep didn't help. It's another thing. Flight hunting. Where am I going to stay until I sort something out? A hotel? A motel? I can't afford that. My money went on Norman's treatment. Well, there must be someone you can stay with till things blow over. Don't worry, I wasn't expecting you to offer. I'll find somewhere. <laughs> well, if you haven't sorted things with Norman first. No chance. You say that now, but I'm sure you're going to get through this. Yes. Um. Yeah. Doesn't matter. I'll just come home at lunchtime, okay? Right. Is that a Pix phone? Yeah, it's the latest one. Let's have a look. <laughs> Your mum's pretty choice. <laughs> Not. Back up the truck. Claire Solomon. Got any others of her? No, I only got the phone yesterday. So do you want to hang out with us or what? Yeah, you know, whatever. Okay, maybe you can. It all depends. On what? On whether you can do a little job I got lined up for you. For this, I plaited yellow palm, but you can also use cane palm or queen palm. A woman from the Walk With Club did really well at Ellerslie a few years back with these. She spray painted them baby blue, which I thought was a bit different. Uh, sorry to interrupt, Yvonne. Uh, it's fine, really. <laughs> I was just wondering whether your gorgeous daughter was around. Which one? Uh, Tanya. One moment, please. Staff Nurse Jeffries to reception, please. Staff Nurse Jeffries. That's Tanya, not Maya, thank you. I don't know. That baby blue's not such a bad idea. Sorry? Well, it's one of my better ones, but I don't know. What do you think? Yeah, well, it's nice, but I see what you mean. There's maybe something missing. This had better be good, Mother. Gentleman caller for your dear. <clears throat> I'm really sorry. I had no idea she was going to do that. Oh, hey, no hassle. Look, um, Tony's organised a few drinks tonight. Uh, wonder if you want to tag along. Oh, well, I don't think I'm doing anything. Sure, yeah, why not? Good. Uh, text me when you finish work, I'll pick you up. Excellent. Ah. Hey, you looking for me? Uh, not this time, actually, no. We can catch up tonight anyway. Sorry, mate, I can't do the bathroom. No, I'm talking about drinks at your place. Tony's organised it. Oh, great. Craig's on my back at the moment. I've got to keep my head down. I'm sure you won't mind if you have a couple of drinks. You'll probably be there anyway. Yeah, another good reason to steer clear. As soon as I've scored some points with the boss, I'll be back on the party trail again. Until then, I'm staying clean. This is nice. You should forget your lunch more often, Dan. Yeah, anything beats the cruddy food at the canteen at school. Oh, no, I used to love the tuck shop. Mm, pies and donuts. You are joking. Mm, is it all health food now? Soggy salad rolls and warm yoghurt. Mm -hmm. Things have certainly changed since my day. Oh, you little loser! Sorry, oh, sorry. 
sorry. It was just an accident. Yo, well, maybe if you weren't staring at your stupid phone the whole time. Oops. I truly didn't mean to. Oh, I know you didn't, buddy. Just go and get a paper towel and we'll clean it up. Ooh, mathematics. Scary. It's only easy. Mm, and things were definitely different. What's this? Leave my things alone. Who wrote that stuff in your book? Don't know, Travis probably. I thought he was a nice boy. We do it all the time. But I don't understand why he'd write that nasty stuff in your book. We were bored of maths. Writing dumb notes in each other's books, that's all. But they're not very nice things to say, Dan. Forget about it. Has anybody seen my space school uniform? Um, mm. it's in the washing. It's clean, though. You're lucky for you, you little shrimp. Bring it out when you've changed and I'll soak it. 